everybody and welcome to Daniel's Late Toy Showcase. Today we are going to be reviewing this 2015 Ford Mustang GT police car. Now this is a pretty cool little car here. So let's get into this review. Oh yeah. Okay, like I said earlier, this is a 2015 Ford Mustang GT police car. And here it is. This is a pretty good car. Here, it's nice and small, which is good. Let's take a look all around. Here's the front. Here's the side. The rear. And back to the side of the Mustang. Now let's go get a little bit more in depth overall for this mustang here's how the front looks with the mustang horse right here some lights on here with actually really good detailing and on the other side it looks like some fog lights here and there and also a nice big grill house and on top of the hood it says police and there's some vents on either side right there and nice ridges, but this hood cannot open, which is okay. Here are the wheels. They are pretty nice wheels, and they spin very well. And it looks like that the unit number is 388. And there's also a 5.0 badge, which is for the engine, because this is a, has a 5 liter V8 under the hood. On the door, there's a, their police star, and also it says police. There's a to protect and serve badge right there. And also a dial 911 emergency. And here are the rear wheels. And also there's the rear reflector right there. And this is how it looks from the back. Here is the back with the GT badge right there. A Mustang badge right there. The tail lights right there and there. And there's also the reverse light right there. And these have dual exhaust. One there. And one right there. And also there's a little bit of a spoiler up top. And there's also a trunk here. Which doesn't open. Which is fine. And here's on the other side. And you can go back to the front. Here's up on the top, you can see the windshield wipers right there and there. And also a little bit of the interior. And also here are the lights. The red, white, and blue lights. And also toward the back, there's another 388 unit badge right there. And also you can see a little bit of the back. This does have mirrors, but they are not real. They, there are no mirrors in them, which is fine, but they do look pretty good. And also, I like the coloring of the white and gray on each side. And the doors can open on each side, and there's a little bit of detailing on the door handle right there. And also the door panel and everything. And also, you can see what's inside, and it looks pretty nice, and that's how it looks with the seats. The steering wheel, and also there's some buttons to press, some air conditioning. You can see the gauge cluster in there. And it looks pretty nice in there for this model. Here's a look through the passenger side. And you can see a little bit of the shifter right there. And the infotainment system right there for the screen. Where you would get all of your apps and da data. Some cup holders right there, and you can see the two little holes. And also a center console. Also, this is all made out of metal, so it's nice and tough and hard. And also, when you close the doors, you can hear the metal, which is always nice to have a solid car, especially when you're chasing those criminals. And also, um, for the rear tires, this has a pullback feature. So basically, if you pull it back, hold it, pull it back, Hold, pull, and then it can just go right there by itself, which is 
a pretty cool feature to have. And this is really powerful, and just by rolling it two times and letting it go, you can hear the, all the power coming out. Take a listen. And it moves pretty quickly, which is good. Let's take a look underneath. And you can see your chrome exhaust again. And here's the front with some engine stuff and the drive shaft. And you can see it says 2015 Ford Mustang GT scale 138. And that's pretty good. And that's basically it for this 2015 Ford Mustang GT police car. And if you never ever need the police, just dial 911 for police, fire, and ambulance. Stay tuned, guys, for more of my videos on Daniel's Toy Showcase and Daniel's Lego Review. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys!